the assistant car for our filming. We've got a vehicle with a misfire, two cylinders misfire, so it's running on two cylinders only. I've set up the Pico scope to measure the current and the voltage of one injector, as it's a piezo injector. Petrol engine with a piezo injector. Yep. You can talk through it if you want. You can quite simply see a number three cylinder. We've got a voltage probe in red, and we have our 20, uh, 60 amp meter connected, but it's in 20 amp mode. And this is the signal which is now paused, which basically shows the injector. I don't need to go into how piezo injectors work, that's something else. But all I'm trying to show today is that how useful this scope is to diagnose. Now, we're going to start the engine and transfer to our faulty cylinder. Number one to start with. This is our good cylinder. Yeah, so that's a good cylinder. There's the injection pulse there, the current and voltage. Swap this over now. The yellow wire. You always have to make sure you get that the right way. Sometimes you have to flip the polarity. Oh, you won't get the uh, signal. Now then, we just change this now to channel A. Actually, what channel are we on there? Actually, that is channel A, isn't it? That's pause channel C. No. Is that channel C? It is, isn't it? Yeah. That's pause channel C. We don't need that now. So there's basically nothing there on channel one, which is the yellow one. Basically dead. Well, you can see a current, there's no voltage, it's all over the place, look. But basically, the problem with that is, probably the MOSFET transistor in the DME, the engine ECU, which is MSD80, Siemens fuel injections. This is the problem engine control unit, and I've found one fault, which could be cylinder one or four, I haven't found if it's for cylinder one or four yet. But basically you've got the MOSFET transistors, as you can see, the source, the gate and the drain. Let's pick one that I know works. Let's go to the drain, the gate, the source. As you can see, there's no continuity. Let's go to this one. That's a broken transistor, it's shorted to the the source is shorted to the drain, that's shorted to the drain, which means this gives this type of signal and that's why the injector doesn't work. However, I've tested all of these, some are for the ignition coils, some are for the injectors, and all of them are okay except that one, but yet there's a misfire in two cylinders, on both one and four cylinders, which means there's a problem. It's already got a new injector, a coil and a plug, which was carried out at a previous repair company. I've also repaired the harness connector on number four because it's been probed from the front incorrectly by another company. So I'll need to check the connector on number one if it's a problem and then check the wiring for voltage drop between the DME and the DME. But certainly it can be repaired, but obviously professional organisation that we are, we would recommend the replacement for the customer. And possibly there'll be another repair on number one.